At the beginning of the pandemic, the scripture that the Lord gave me was um, Isaiah 26, 20. It's pretty good. It says, go my people, enter your rooms and close your doors behind you. Hide for a little while until the wrath has passed. So right in the beginning, it was like I went in, shut the door, got on my face and went, here we go, God. And um, I think when the church actually starts believing this stuff, we're going to see the provision of God and the presence of God Mm. in the midst of all of this. And that is what is going to separate us from a freaking out lost and broken world. But when we act just like the world with the same fear, the same anxiety, the same gossip, the same slander, the same envy, the same greed, the same arguing, the same divide the same chaos. There is no evidence that the Spirit of God is on us. The evidence of the Kingdom of God ultimately isn't even all the stuff we do out there. It's righteousness, joy and peace in the Holy Ghost. And if we, the church, in the midst of a global pandemic and all of the other crises that are happening in the world, the thing that is going to separate us is not how smart we are to answer the problems of this um, era, but it's when we can display righteousness, joy and peace.